Good morning. Today is President's Day 2022. That's February 21st. It's uh, in the, the uh, last quarter of winter. Doing some winter camping up at Rensselaerville State Forest uh, Campsite 2. Uh, this is a nice campsite. Uh, I haven't camped up here in a long time. Uh, for a while they had a bunch of uh, camping by permit only signs and I'm not going to bother getting a permit. But I didn't want to go too far from home and the signs are down. I don't know if they were stolen or if they just dropped the permit requirement, but I don't care. There's no signs. It's nothing on their website. I checked the DEC website. So they will all come up here and uh, camp. If I can't get this campsite, I'll drag gear back. But I actually was able to uh, cut back the snowbank and set up camp with the truck camper. Um, you know, it didn't, wasn't heated, but uh, you know, with enough blankets, it's actually not at all cold. People think, oh, it would be freezing if you're in, you know, it's 25 degree weather and uh, have the uh, um, you know, no heat, but uh, it really isn't with the blankets. It was plenty warm, very salty up uh, on the roads coming out here. Red needs a wash really badly. Um, I'll wash it uh, tomorrow after work, I think. Yeah. It's gonna be 50, it's gonna be raining tomorrow, but it'll be 55 degrees. And I think that's gonna be better there to wash the truck. So, yeah, road's a little icy. Um, I actually ended up going. I drove right past this campsite because it's on, you know, it's kind of on a little bit of a hill here. And I just didn't notice the campsite driving up here. And I had to carve back the snowbank. I just didn't want to get hung up on it. As you can see, it's actually a. I don't think I even got down to the ground, but uh, I didn't want to leave a big snowbank and get hung up on the uh, bank. I had that happen once. You think you had to lift it? Oh, you're never going to get hung up. Uh, you get a big snowbank, uh, you get under the axle, and your wheels just spin, even with the four wheel drive. Yeah, four-wheel drive is great as a lift kit for the snow, but it's not, um, you know, it won't save your ass every time, as I learned one time years ago, up in the Adirondacks with snowbanks. So I'm real careful with snowbanks, and everything is packed ice here, so it took like a half hour to dig that snowbank out, and I snapped my one shovel that would have been falling apart for a while. So yeah, it's a nice new forest here, so it's uh, a lot of wildlife to watch here. I see a lot of birds this morning, and uh, not too cold. Uh, got down to about 25 last night, so we up to 50 today. Yesterday was in the th low 30s, which, you know, it's winter, but uh, that's actually warmer than it was when I was camping uh, a good portion of uh, November and December those days. Um, just burned up some poopy toilet paper because I didn't want to leave that. I mean, I buried the poop as much as I could away from the campsite but you know I, I knew I wasn't going to get the toilet paper good and well buried so I didn't want to have you know something come across uh, paper flower come uh, come when things fly out but yeah the heater's been working great ever since I cleaned it out uh, that one time with the pilot light it's been fantastic camp stove's been fairly good um yeah nice fire I was up till about 10 last night and it started getting cold and I was I didn't want to feel like throwing up more wood. I usually go to bed around, uh, most nights even at home, at around 9, 8 o'clock. I know it sounds lame and I get up at 5, but I sleep a lot better that way. The same thing this morning, I actually got up at, uh, I got up actually around 6, and uh, it was still dark out. It was just starting to get light out, but I had I lit to the lantern, turned the lantern on and the lights for a little bit. 